Hello, Brian Knowlton back with another super cool slide reel tutorial. In this tutorial, we will check the operation of an air proving switch, also called a cell switch. For starters, I removed the screws on the side that hold it in place. Next, what I'm doing is there is a rubber or a silicone tube on the back. disconnect it. The tools we need will be an electrical tester. We set it to continuity. Disconnect your wires. Make sure your furnace is unplugged before you begin all this. Even though this is low voltage here. Now what a, an air proving switch does is when the combustion air blower motor turns on and runs, it creates negative pressure in this box. The negative pressure is sensed through the hose and the, the diaphragm switch closes allowing continuity to travel through. Um, the normal position as it is now uh, should be normally open. So with the tester on continuity I test the two leads here. They are definitely open. Making sure, test my tester to tester. Now, to test the operation, believe it or not, what we do, um, we put one lead on each wire. and we suck. That is checking the operation of a cell switch. This cell switch is good. The, this concludes our tutorial on checking a air proving switch. Please stay tuned while we introduce the super cool slide rule. It is the coolest tool in air conditioning. I'd like to take a minute to introduce you to the coolest tool in the HVAC industry. Historically, Technicians have carried four or five different slide rules. You have one for R22, one for R410A, one for metal duct sizing, one for flexible duct sizing, and yet others for diagnostics or troubleshooting. Thankfully, those days are gone. This one tool will allow you to charge a system with R22 or R410A in either the superheat or subcooling method. The back cover contains required formulas, it has capacitors, rules, and practices a wet bulb conversion chart, how to perform computations on series or parallel circuits, an electric heat strip guide, a complete system troubleshooting diagnostic chart, and how to troubleshoot compressors in TXV. Inside is packed with even more information. It performs sizing of both metal and flexible duct. It has the only direct reading conversion from smooth metal to insulation line metal we've ever seen. The majority of technicians have never been taught that if the insulation is on the inside of the ductwork, you cannot size it with a regular duct calculator. It has step-by-step -step directions for determining airflow through a gas furnace, electric furnace, or an air conditioning unit. It has pressure drop multipliers for ductwork, as well as recommended velocities. And finally, the scanning of this QR code gives instant access to over 100 tutorials to assist the technician with every test and repair imaginable. You owe it to yourself as well as your customers to own this tool. It's less than $20 including shipping. The SuperCool will save you countless hours of frustration when troubleshooting units. Log on to our website and get one today and I promise you will be a better technician tomorrow. And remember, every technician is only as good as their tools. Thanks for watching.